Outside, Inside, written by Anne Hearth. Lucy colored in the sky. Can I have the blue crayon when you're finished? Jalissa asked. All finished, Lucy said, as she handed Jalissa the crayon. Dad knocked on the door. We need to paint your room this weekend, Lucy, he said. He ran one finger along a crack in the tan paint. What color? Lucy asked. Any color you like, said Dad. Really? Lucy sat up straight. Dad nodded. We'll go to the paint store tomorrow. He closed the door. You're so lucky, Jalissa said. Any color? What are you going to choose? Lucy looked around her room. White? Snowflakes are white. Fluffy clouds are white too, said Jalissa. Yes, said Lucy, but my bedspread is yellow. Maybe yellow. I love yellow, said Jalissa. Corn is yellow. So is butter. Yum. Lucy looked at the picture she just colored. She glanced out the window. The sun was shining. I can't decide, she said. Let's go for a walk. Maybe that will help. The girls went to the park. Lucy took a deep breath. She smelled the green grass. She walked in the shade of the green trees. She looked into the blue sky. She loved to be outside more than anything. That's it, Lucy said. Jalissa jumped. What? I'll paint the ceiling blue like the sky. The walls can be green like the trees and the grass. It will be just like being outside. Lucy and her dad painted her room the next day. Lucy even painted a shiny yellow sun in one corner. It was beautiful. It was like a walk in the park on a summer day. On Friday after school, Jalissa and Lucy walked home together. So, Lucy said, do you want to sleep over tonight? Yes, Jalissa said. I'll ask my mom. Great, said Lucy. We can sleep outside, inside my room. Outside, inside, comprehension questions. Number one, what color is Lucy's room at the beginning of the story? Good. Number two, what does Lucy love more than anything? Great. Number three, how do Lucy and Jalissa get home from school? Number four, what colors does Lucy choose for her room? Great work.